What have you done to me? I don't know. Believe me, believe me, believe me. It got to be you. I need you. I need you. Let me just do this zip. Walk, walk back the bridge, are they? Don't fold your back. That's it. I will see iron all this clean yeah. before you come and collect it. I'll see iron it. <laughs> you made the stress. Ah. My what? goodness. You know that you are using eyes to block me. But you did me go. Ah. I saw for Tiwa Savage. I saw for Beyonce. I saw for Rita Ora. Even go yeah. recently. As I saw for that girl I think in America. Go, 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 go. Guys, I'm back. And this video is all about my pre-wedding shoot. I know. I know you guys are looking forward to the trad video. And trust me, it's coming. In fact, it's actually the video right after this one. But you know, it's a sequel. I have to get you guys up to speed with what happened or some events that happened that led up to my trad wedding day. So you know what you're going to do for me, guys. You guys are just going to sit back, relax, and enjoy this movie. But before we get to that, guys, I have a little update. <laughs> so I'm back to Abuja. I'm in my house. I don't know why it's not clear. But I'm in my house and I actually told her that I wanted food. And she sent me food. Let me show you guys what she sent me. <laughs> hello everyone what is up and welcome back to my youtube channel it is me it is i baby coax and you're welcome back to another vlog guys i know i know i've been so busy i know i haven't checked in with you guys in like two weeks right now i apologize for that i've just been trying to plan this wedding guys it's sooner than you think and there's a lot of things i haven't done so i've just been back to back trying to sort everything out the days are going by really fast and i still have a ton of shit to do I'm also trying to plan my content as well the wedding content i will be putting out looking for music all of that kind of stuff i've also been watching a ton of videos which brings me to the sponsor of this video skillshare i know i've spoken about skillshare so many times in the past and i will be speaking about it again today okay if you don't know what Skillshare is Skillshare is an online learning platform with thousands of online classes in over 150 countries there's so many courses on Skillshare you can take it's a learning platform that lets you harness your skills introduces you to a world of different topics and classes you can take I know Skillshare is known for its photography videography graphic design illustration classes but do you know you can also take career based or career focused classes on Skillshare like starting a business how to market being a good marketer for your brand or just like the tips and tricks that kind of gets your video out there production and time management there are a lot of courses you can take beyond photography videography graphic design illustration it's a website of so many classes for you to take all right guys so i'm on the skillshare website and i just finished taking this course by halis navayas i hope i'm not butchering the name i apologize if i am it's basically called video for instagram tell an engaging story in less than a minute guys i absolutely enjoy Enjoyed being in this class okay basically this class just kind of teaches you how to incorporate different filming and editing techniques um, it also goes over like some technical knowledge what to keep in mind before you construct your story um, and it's perfect if you're a beginner who's interested in self-expression or you're a pro like a seasoned creator who just is looking for like a burst of inspiration this class was really insightful I absolutely enjoyed it and um, I actually encourage you guys to take this particular course especially if you're trying to brush up your skills when it comes to storytelling um, on Instagram and to be honest you can actually apply a bit of these techniques for your YouTube or your TikTok as well this year is the perfect time to reinvent yourself and invest 
in your career. It's really affordable and the first 1,000 people to click the link in my description box to sign up on Skillshare get one month free trial, okay? You get one month to surf the web, see if there are any courses you like, take some courses because like I said, there are lots of courses to take on Skillshare. So yeah, thank you so much to Skillshare for sponsoring this part of the video. And without further ado, let's get on with the rest of the vlog. Hey guys, I woke up not too long ago and I'm about to cook, guys. I actually want to make something tasty for my fiance. I feel like this wedding has also been stressful on his end, so I just want to treat him and, you know, just make something nice. You know, he's a potato man, so he likes fried yam, so I want to make him fried yam and, you know, sauce with like corned beef, smoked fish, normal fish, prawns, you know, um, sausages all of that good stuff so i'm going to be taking you guys along and let's get to cooking cj can gift it just for front of your house. Did they buy the firewood? Huh? Yeah. I'm going to be adding this. And it's been peeled and washed and all of that stuff. This fish as well. We add in that in there right now. So the sauce is ready. I'm going to fry my yam now so I can have it with some sauce. Hmm, guys, my husband has been doing the Lord's work. Alright guys, so it's finally the day of my pre-wedding shoot and <laughs> when I tell you this day was crazy guys, like it was super crazy. I started off really early at the hair salon, I decided to launch this new weave I got sometime last year on AliExpress, so um, that took a while. In fact, the hairstylist had to even follow me to the makeup studio because we were running behind time, so I got my makeup done. Thankfully, I was able to finish both my hair and my makeup. And then I went to my family house to pick up my outfit. My fiance picked me up from there. And then um, we decided to head to the location for the shoot. Hey everyone, look guys, today, today's my pre-wedding shoot. I know it's starting off weirdly, but I promise it's going to make sense. I'm done with my hair and makeup, obviously. So actually a route to the location. I have my clothes and everything in my box. I packed last minute. You know me, I work best under pressure. 
anyway i just thought to check in with you guys and just update you on what's happening when we get there i'll vlog as well i'll show you behind the scenes of the pre-wedding shoot stay tuned and i'll see you guys We've arrived at the location and we're actually shooting at a family friend's house so the photographer is here the videographer is here the bridal assistant is here as well to help me out with my dress and all of that so as soon as i got in i didn't waste much time i went straight to dress up because like i said we were behind time and me vivian i was going to make sure i got both outfits in good lighting so yeah that's what happened Hi guys, I'm sweating like a Christmas goat. Well, I've started to this my first time. So we kicked off this photo shoot in this English outfit. My gorgeous, gorgeous dress is from Nifa Studios. I don't know where my fiance's suit is from and I didn't ask. Oops. We actually had no mood board when it came to this pre-wedding shoot. We both just knew we didn't want to go past two outfits. And a big, big shout out to my stylist, styled by Zachary, for coming through with the styles because I take no credit for that. She was able to send me the styles and I took it up from there. Um, the shoot was so, so much fun. The photographer and videographer, like everybody's energy was in high spirits and I absolutely enjoyed the session. The photographer on set is Kunle Lanyon and the videographer on set is Buka Shots Pictures. Oh, wow. <laughs> 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 oh Vivi, your reaction is perfect. Close your eyes. Uh, no. You can't. If it kisses you, you can close your eyes. Bye. Forget one hand on his face. Drop your hand first. Gimbal guy, please, you help me. Camera rolling. Um, action, let's go. Let's go. Beautiful. Drop your hand now. Drop it again. Now, action, take it up. Beautiful. Oh, wow, this is beautiful. God bless you. And just in case you don't know what a pre-wedding shoot is, a pre-wedding shoot is typically a photo shoot that happens weeks to months prior to your wedding day. It really depends on you and the photographer. And another frequently asked question when it comes to pre-wedding shoots is, is it necessary? Is it compulsory? Must I have a pre-wedding shoot? And personally, I would say it is compulsory, okay? It's it's important because outside, you know, making memories memories and um having pictures that you can look back on and kind of just um track your journey it's also another opportunity to bond with your photographer or videographer okay it gives you the opportunity to kind of discuss your best angles the kind of shoots you'd like and just being comfortable with your photographer and vice versa so i highly recommend having a pre-wedding shoot it doesn't have to be elaborate or something you know extravagant it could even be in your house okay 
okay it can be anywhere and if you can't afford a photographer you can get a friend of yours right now people take amazing pictures with your phones so if push comes to shove like you can actually do that and you still come out with really amazing pictures so as you can see i have changed to my second outfit um and shout out to my friend and my cousin oh my god like they really came through for me and i can't even explain how it would have gone if they were not around so shout out to you guys amina and uchechi thank you so much for coming through for me and i actually called amina the day of my shoot and she came through she helped me with my gele and that was just so so nice and like i said i'm so thankful everything went really well so um yeah enjoy and i'll see you guys in a bit Yes, yes. I'm going to come. Yes, yes. Do it. I'm about to come. I'm going 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 to Oh Jesus! Bo, <laughs> just try. No, this way, this way. Look at this. Oh my goodness! Too much. Yeah, this one, I play it for you. <laughs> 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 the last one is here. Just try. Stop, please now. Akuval, please now. Do this for us, for the culture, please. But this prep will prep. We are good for one. Akuval, do this now. I'm not seeing your face again. Akuval, you're hiding. Akuval, you're hiding. Ah, guys, finally, we're done with this shoot. Hey, if I tell you I'm not tired, I'm actually lying. Both of us were knackered after this shoot. But it was really, really fun, and I'm glad everything went well. So, yeah, after the shoot, I ate, and then I called it a night. like i have a lot of things to do today but i'm actually hoping i'm able to finish everything i have to do this is actually how i woke up but i'm going to the salon like right now um i want to pick up something it will say too from there i'm going to the salon the salon is in otaku but i think i'll just go to one you will say too so i can do my hair this is actually a frontal um i had a shoot on sunday so this is my hair from the shoot so i'm going to laze you know I want them to touch it up. Then from there, I have a meeting with um, some of the vendors. Yeah, actually, most like all of the vendors. I have a vendors meeting after. I look so beat up. It's still early for me, but 
guys i just thought to check in it's really important because i'm really trying my best to keep the vlogs alive update you guys on what i'm up to and um create memories you know oh by the way this is what i'm eating this is um real fruits coconut chips caramel it's actually really nice see you guys later But guys, I'm done from the salon. I just got to the location. I feel like I'm quite late. But... This long speech, which will do it one more time for you who just came. We're not going to go. It's not going to be long this time. 48 hours before the event, please. We need the names of all the people that are working with your company. Full names. Full names. First name, Full last name, and their phone numbers. Okay. Uh, we need. And if you want to send us their picture, you can. We need to identify everyone that's going to be at this event. Anyone who comes without proper ID or identification, they will not be allowed. Or is a different person ID from us, we won't allow them into the home. We won't allow them onto our premises, okay? That includes your drivers. Your drivers are not coming into the hall anyways, but because they're going to be working in this vicinity, we need their information. Please, please, and please. So please. basically, you indicate their names, phone numbers, and what their role is, and then they have to come along with a form of ID. It could be their ATM card, it could be whatever. It can be on their phone, but we just need to... If you send us their picture ahead of time, that's fine if they forget that it, but... For yes, that will suffice for identification, please. Okay, thank you. You have 12 staff. So at the vendors meeting. Staff. Okay. okay, so a vendors meeting is typically a meeting between the vendors and the planners. Okay, it's actually optional for the couple to attend, but we decided to attend just because we wanted to feel involved with what was going on. But basically, um, it's just an interaction between both parties to kind of confirm the negotiation that was done and for the planners to also lay like the rules and regulations. So just everything can just fall in place and go according to plan so it was really really nice i'm glad we were able to attend my fiance actually came from work so um that was really nice so yeah that's pretty much what happened and it just got me really excited for the actual day So today I'm a mirror skincare as you guys can see. I'm having my facial today. Yesterday I did my hammam body scrub, which is why my nails are this way, because it used the turmeric and all of that. But right now I'm about to get a facial. I feel sick. I look sick. I'm under the weather. But I think I'm getting something with Mandelic today. I'll confirm and I'll put it on the screen though. I just thought to check in. Um just prepping for my big day. So we're doing um Demo planning, hydro facial, and um, the mandelic acid. Oh my god, okay, guys, my face is about to be transformed. Bear in mind, guys, when I woke up this morning, I took a shower, but I did not do anything to my face no skincare, no nothing. I wanted to come with my face, let it know. I didn't want my face to get sensitive or anything, so my face is prepped and ready for this facial. So, yeah, aside from being sick, I'm really excited. So, yeah, let's go. This 
is not dedication i don't know what it is i'm so sick i feel like i'm coming down with something um and i had i took malaria injection this morning just before my facial but this is a couple hours after my facial and i just thought to pop in and just show you guys what my skin is looking like i really love the glow i just even hopped off a video call and my friend was like damn your skin is glowing i'm like i know i feel feverish i have cough kata headache i feel dizzy nauseous all of that i haven't eaten but i'm going to eat soon like i can't be sick right now like this sickness did not come since and it's now now i reject it it's not my portion i refuse to be sick in jesus name i'm healed in jesus name amen anyway just thought to check in with you guys Hi. Okay, i actually love her Don't you know, Maria? We're single, I'm going to